Hey guys, welcome back to my channel today. Today we're going to be diving into the Chic Beauty Box. This is a bi-monthly beauty subscription box and you will receive makeup in this subscription box. It's actually one of their guarantees on their website is that you are guaranteed to receive makeup inside of this beauty box. So we're going to be unboxing the July-August 2022 box today. So let's go ahead and dive in and see what we have. So if you guys are interested in purchasing this subscription box, this will retail for $34.99 every other month is the way it will work. There is an $8 shipping fee as well, but then they guarantee you'll receive five beauty products every other month with your box. Now I'm always shocked. This box is small. I mean, it's tiny, it's little, but yet they always send us really good beauty products inside of it. I'm always happy with this box. It's not even a box that I have to worry about or doubt or go, oh, is it going to be a good month? Is it going to be bad? Because let's face it, there are beauty boxes out there that I do that with that I'm like, I have no idea what we're going to get. But Chic, on the other hand, is very consistent. So I always feel like you're going to get a good box no matter what month it is. So inside of your box, per usual, you will have a card that will talk about the items inside of the box itself. There will be two variations. So you'll have variation one or variation two, and then it will list the items down below. You don't really know which variation you're going to get, though, until you start unboxing and then you're like, oh, that's the one I have. So the first product inside of my box then is from Milk Makeup and this is their Lip Metal. It is a full size product that we have here today. So this is going to be their lip product. We have it in the shade Slayer. I really like this color. I'm kind of shocked because I am not one, first off, I'm not really a lip person to begin with. I'm all about eyes, but I'm not really into lip stuff. But this color is very, very pretty. I like that it's got kind of like a berry tone, but it's a deeper berry tone. So I feel like this would look really good this fall. It's coming at the perfect time. Milk Makeup, obviously it's a great brand, so I'm excited about that. But yeah, this color, like, I don't know. I kind of think this color is really pretty. I like it a lot. Now, if you are going to purchase this, it comes in at $24 for it. Now, you could receive this product or you could receive a face gloss instead. But we received the lip metal inside of our box, so it looks like we have variation two today. Next product is going to be from NARS. Whoops, here, let me turn around. There we go. So our next item is from NARS, and this is their Smudge Proof Eyeshadow Base. So does that mean that this is like an eyeshadow primer then is my guess? I really love NARS for some of their products, but I'm not familiar with their entire line. Now this is going to be in medium to dark, it says. So this is probably going to be too dark for me because I am definitely more towards the other end of the spectrum. So this is what our shade will look like. Yeah, definitely got a medium skin tone here. And so I feel like this is gonna be your base that you're gonna put on before your eyeshadow then to really hold everything in place, but it's gonna be more of that skin color. It matches perfectly. What you see on the bottle is definitely what you get. This is a full-size product that we have here today, and this product will come in at $26 for this one. Now, typically with the Chic Beauty Box, they will send you not only high-end brand names, but also drugstore brand names as well. And sometimes you can find some real winners with that. So I don't really find that to be a big deal. One of them is going to be from Jordana in here. They also will carry other brands like Revlon and CoverGirl. We've had a variety of products from them before as well, but this is going to be the Triple Play All Over Color Application. This is in the shade Pink Nectar, and it will give you color in less than 30 seconds, it says. So when it says All Over Color, I'm guessing... This is like a stick to give you some blush then? Maybe use it for your lips? I'm not quite sure. It doesn't really give me any more info than just that, but that's how I would use it. Oh wait, yes it does. See, I just have to keep reading. So this will apply to cheeks, your lips, or your eyes for a healthy touch of color with this product then. Okay, so we'll go ahead and take a quick peek here at this color as to how it does. First off, there is a bit of sweating happening. So this is a cream-based product. 
Um, it just, it's very warm outside right now. And so it just came inside from being on my front porch. And so I can understand why it's sweating. It feels a little bit warm, even in the package itself. I can see this color working for lips. I definitely could see it for a cheek color as well. So this is just a all over color you could use anywhere. So we actually got another NARS product in our box as well. This is the Sunkissed Bronzing Cream. I really hope this isn't too dark because I am really excited to try this. I love bronzers. I always have. I love all makeup. I really do. I don't know why I always say that I like certain things, but I just really want to try this one. So I hope it's good. I'm getting excited now about this product. Full size product. It's in the shade Laguna. No idea if that's dark or if that's light. So we're going to open it up here, but I am really excited for a bronzer. The only thing I wish with NARS is that I wish they were a cruelty free brand. That's the only thing that I don't like about them. So this is how the product itself looks. Ooh, well, bronzers are supposed to be darker than your regular skin tone, but I don't know. This seems really dark. You guys, it says sunkissed bronzing cream. So it is a cream product. And then this is what it looks like. I will have to work with it. My hunch is this is going to be a little too dark for me, or I would really have to get a solid tan to really work, make this work. The nice thing though about cream products is they will blend out and you can usually, you know, really lighten them down. So I might be able to work with it, but either way, I'm excited to try it. At least I can find out the formula, if it works, if it sticks. But if you guys have used this product, comment down below and let me know what you think of it because I am really excited to find out. You know, I totally forgot to tell you guys the price tag on the last one. So the Jordana color is $20. And then this NARS cream bronzer is $38 for this one. Last item inside of our box then is going to be a palette. So this is going to be an eyeshadow palette. This is from CoverGirl and it's called the Overthrown Eyeshadow Palette. I love the packaging already on this. Like I'm excited to see the color story inside of this palette right now because it looks really pretty. And I think there's going to be some colors on here. So this is a full size product. Let me go ahead and cut the seal off of here for you guys. And this is what it looks like. Okay. So for starters, not at all what I was expecting. Um, there's a lot more packaging than there is product inside of this palette. There is a mirror up top and then down below you have your shades, but the pans are ridiculously small and some of them are smaller than others. So I'm going to hold this up here and you guys can take a look at it. But I mean, for this whole palette, do you see how small it is? There's just so much packaging. And then you get a couple of these that are very skinny, narrow shadows that I've never seen that before. I don't know if I necessarily hate it, but I also feel like there was plenty of room to give me more space, you know, to really pull these out. I do think the colors are giving me this look. They've got names such as Fallen, Legacy, Wreckage, Dethroned, Taken. So I definitely can see the story they're going with. It's a little bit darker of a palette. So I get it but I think it could have been a little bigger. Now this palette is only $9 for it and I totally see why it's $9 because you're not getting a lot of product there. So that is everything inside of our Chic Beauty Box for July and August. Comment down below and let me know what you guys think of course. I feel like there are some really great products in here and great brands. I feel like my shades though are off with this box. That's the only thing is they all came out a little bit darker than what, than what I am. So I'm going to have to work with those, but I still feel like you're getting a great value. I love that we get makeup in this box. The entire box was filled with makeup products. So it's just, that's just awesome in itself. So comment down below, let me know what you think, but until next time, you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you all in my next unboxing video. Bye.